The bus bar is a crucial component in smart film and glass technology. This strip conducts electricity to give smart glass its switchable effect. It's typically six millimeters wide, about a quarter of an inch, and runs from one side of the panel to the other with a small gap in between. You'll often find bus bars positioned on the same side of the panel. We recommend positioning the bus bar along the top where it is less susceptible to water accumulation and damage. Each bus bar features two copper pads that act as flexible conductors, one on each side. These flexible conductors ensure that electricity flows efficiently. One of the pads is a spare, there to safeguard against potential damage, so your smart film or glass will always function, even if one side experiences wear or malfunction. This is a hallmark feature of quality, smart glass and film. Bus bars should always be insulated, especially if your smart film or glass is installed near metal windows or door frames. Insulation is critical to prevent short circuits, which could result in damage. For larger panels or those with a width to height ratio exceeding one to three, a bus bar should be placed on the longer side or additional bus bars may be required on both the top and bottom of the panel. When connecting your controller to the bus bar, pay close attention to the wiring. You'll see two colored wires, black and red. It's important to connect the wires correctly, black to black, red to red. Mixing these up could result in poor function or even damage your smart film or glass. Watch this video for instructions on pairing the controller with the smart film or glass. Worried about the appearance of the bus bar? Don't worry, it can easily be hidden by the frame, vinyl strips, or the trim. It all depends on your unique project. Proper installation is key for optimal performance. Ensure bus bars are correctly connected, insulated, and protected.